In this episode, I'm going to show you how to make these beautiful high heel ornaments. For this project, you will need scissors, double-sided tape, masking tape, pliers, wire, wire cutter. You will also need beads, a paper punch, glue, ribbon, cardstock, and of course the template. You also need a pencil. Using the template, you're going to trace the shape of the shoe in the back of the cardstock that you want to use. Then you want to sort of cut an area that it is large enough to hold two of them. Going to fold that. And then you proceed to cut. The reason why, why I'm cutting the two sections together is that I want them to be identical. And that's the easiest way because we always make little mistakes when we are cutting. But if they are all, if you're cutting at the same time, they will fit. So I got my two pieces. Then I'm going to take the one that I'm going to use as a sole. And I'm going to eyeball you know, a distance that it is about the same from this round part. Imagine that this is a circle. You sort of want to find the center. And using the puncher, I'm going to punch that. Then I'm going to take some wire and you want around eight inches of wire. You don't want a very thick wire. This is um, size 22. So what you want to do is sort of start at the point of the sole, hold a little and make like a little open Z, like that. Okay. Going to put that here, through the hole. You see what I did? Put the wires through the hole. And I'm using little strips of masking tape. I'm going to tape that there. This little Z or S, uh, whatever you want to call it, will give the wire a little stability. So it will make it easier for us to work with the wire later. Just tape it. Just make sure that the tape doesn't come out. Let's start with our ribbon. I recommend, you could use any kind of ribbon, but I recommend a two inch wired uh, ribbon. As you see, this, this ribbon will hold its shape and this will help a little. In the template that you could download in this website or my website, there is a, a, there's this piece that will help you uh, make the bow or this part of the shoe. Um, so what I do is I sort of measure about two, three inches, two and a half inches, and I gather the ribbon and I twist twice maybe three times, so that it stays in place. Use this as a guide. You want to put masking tape outside your template. The reason why I'm doing that is because it will help me glue the piece. So I'm just going to cut then the ribbon, I'm going to leave around half an inch of masking tape. I 
and it should look basically like a butterfly. On one side should be larger, the top side should be larger than the bottom part, sort of like that. So now I'm going to take what will be the insole of the shoe, so more or less in the center. You see the wire helps to keep it in place. I'm going to put a little masking tape here to hold the whole thing, okay, and cut the excess. Put using the wire SI as a guide, just sort of bend the shoe and curve here. So I think that this is, this is good, good height. And now, okay, that looks good. Make sure that you have enough tape on the widest part Including, including that tip of the shoe. Okay, so I'm going to start from the top. Use your nail to hold the wire. So now you could see the heel. We will use beads to create a heel. And I found these uh, beads that I, I like very much. They're basically round, and I found this metallic uh, piece used for jewelry making that looked like a heel to me. So. so anyway, I start by putting a quarter of an inch round bead and that looks like it will make a good size heel. So then I hold the whole thing and I cut like about a quarter of an inch from the last bead. You should always hold your wire so that it doesn't fly out of the table. And I bend to the, toward the inside of the bead. And then all you have to do is pull this part in or out, I guess, just a little. And you have your high heel ornament. I am Carlos Nelson Molina. Thanks for watching.